What's going on, everybody? Eddie Soundhead back once again with Soundhead Entertainment, and we are back finally in Beeman G Drive once again here to do some monster truck action. I know it's been a minute, but my Beeman G's been acting a little funny lately, and it caused me to kind of take a little break. Plus, the last monster truck update still, you know, broke a bunch of trucks that I really like to use in these types of videos. So, bit of a bummer there, but we got a pretty nice lineup, I think, ready to go here, along with this really awesome US Bank Stadium custom sort of layout track. So, I'll put links in the description for the mods that you can download them if you want to try them out and that'll pretty much do it without any further ado let's go ahead and jump to our first run all right so we're here with the classic bigfoot getting ready to start it off so we'll go ahead and fire it up and we'll put three minutes on the timer on my phone and it will start as soon as we hit our first obstacle so let's go ahead and begin it right now going up the jump you can get some nice air right off the bat doing it to a nice flat landing tipping from side to side Let's get this run underway. Now you can see there are some huge obstacles on this floor, like this big old stack of containers and cars stuck on top of them. We got big old jumps down here. And in fact, I think I'm going to try and line myself up for this big middle jump right here. Back it in the wall and let's go for it. Big over the jump. And we're going to land hard on the back end and that's going to land us down on the front end. But we survived it. Nice air time, nice distance. If it was an Olympic event. We would have got a 10 right there, probably. Well, maybe not on the landing, but Monster Truck should be an Olympic event, if you ask me. And if I were president, they would be, but it's probably for the best that I'm not, if we're going to be honest. So jump clean up that eight pack right there. I finally learned what those are called. Thank you to the comment section for always educating me on things that I don't know. I actually really do appreciate it. Like we're going to appreciate going over this big jump. The fire comes out of it. You love to see that. That's pretty cool. I love the theatrics. Got to go big when you're bringing out the monster truck. So we're going to go big and tall up over this one again. Bounce it off the tailgate. And that's a hard one, too. That's going to hurt the old spinal cord, the neck, a few other things as well. We'll head over the dirt mound again. This is going to land us on the nose. Oh, man. Pull it back. Pull it back. Pull it in reverse. Wait a minute. What a save. Talk about throwing it in reverse at just the right time to get that one back. Wow, all right. I'm kind of surprised we got that one back. We have destroyed the body on this beautiful truck. So we are keeping continuing on. No one knows first end over that jump. Let's hit this jump from the other side. Why not? Full throttle up over it. Settle it down there. It's going to get a kind of hard sideways landing, but we go right into the next jump with that land that nice and pretty. And we have got just over a minute to go. So we got to give them that big wow moment here in the last part of the run. Should we line it up for the back flip? Let's go for it. And we nailed it beautifully, but it's going over on its side. Throw it into reverse. Do something. Now put it in forward gear. Forward gear. There it is. And we get it. And a wheelie to boot. And a back flip. Nailed that throttle. It's just the right time to get the back flip in there. That is a big wow moment to start the show with. That's what we love to see. We're gonna go for the big middle jump again. Why not? Absolutely going for it out here on the first run. And I think we've hit just about everything there is to hit on this floor. We haven't hit this little angle jump on the side here and I'm gonna spin out before I get there. And in fact, oh, my FPS isn't happy about it, but that's okay. We have been tearing this truck up. We're going sideways again, bicycle style. Oh, throw it in reverse, do something. Break dance in the truck. Oh, throw it into a moonwalk while we're at it. Throw it, what? I don't even know what that is, but throw it into that too. And that is gonna do it. The time is expiring right now. We have had an unbelievable run to open up the show with. My goodness, Bigfoot showing up and showing out. Let's get to the next truck. Keeping with the theme of big boys coming out early in this show, we have got another one here, of course, this time the icon Gravedigger with a very special and very awesome looking paint scheme, this being the overcast version. If you're familiar with the Spinmaster toy line of Monster Jam trucks, then you've probably seen this before because that, I believe, is where this is inspired from. And hopefully we can give it a good run because it is a pretty slick looking truck. So we'll go ahead and fire it up, get it rolling here, and we'll start the run. And as soon as we hit our first obstacle, I will start the clock. Once again, the three minute timer has begun. And it starts with a sky wheelie over the dirt mound there. And we're just kind of running over objects now. Let's turn this thing around. Let's get some nice and big air over this center jump. Off to the side a little bit there. Kicked it off to the side, but we land it nice and neat. And we'll get this thing turned around back around the other way. Sling it around, drift it. 
full power over the crush car stack and just all oh, flat landed hard on the other side. Climbing over some more jumps, getting kind of knocked around, but we are slinging this thing right here. Let's hit some of these smaller jumps. Let's see if we can do a little technical move right here. Maybe get a little slap wheelie going. There we go. All right. Hey, walk it across the floor. Why don't we? There you go. That'll give the fans something to talk about. Let it bounce back down here. Turn this thing back around. Sharp turn. And let's jump up this. This one likes to spit us straight up in there and a kind of awkward landing right there. Those jumps are in weird spots, but makes you have to be on your toes. You never know when it'll throw you off in a weird direction. Another sky wheelie here. No shortage of those. And the hood comes off. There you go. We lost our first piece of fiberglass and it's stuck. It's, it's actually staying on for a ride as we're going to just go gloss over the top of the crush cars. Can we save it? Let it roll back over. That's all you need to do. Flying Johnny's a little wrinkled up, but we'll get that thing fixed up with some air. Hopefully, I don't know. Maybe, oh, it just fall off. All right, well, that works too. <laughs> Fair enough. See what we can do with this thing. Stick it straight up in the air once again. Wreck down hard on all four tires. And we're about halfway into this run now. So let's see what we can do. I like getting those technical moves. And here we go. This might be an opportunity for one. There you go. And we're going to kind of crash it into another obstacle here. But we get a chance to pull a save out if we can. And we do. We barely miss hitting that wall. Can I go reverse over this? Oh, of course we can. There we go. Beautiful. And got cleared over it. Hopefully that fire didn't burn us too bad. Should we go for the backflip? Can I go for the consecutive? Oh, there it is. Got that one perfect. That's really the perfect ramp for it. That might not be the last one of those we see today. Should I try and hit it at a bit of an angle? Oh, just to try something different. Oh, no. Oh, Grave Digger. Two wheeled. Oh, no. That is not good. We're keeping it rolling, though. 30 seconds left and two wheels slide it into a donut. Why not? That's about all we're going to be able to do with this thing. That was about as awful of a landing as you're going to get. And I'm going to get sick looking at this. Take a look at this. This is just, we're just going to run the clock out like this. The engine's going to blow before we get to the end of the clock. I can imagine. 10 seconds. It's bogging down now. Just got to end it with about all we can do. Four, three, two, one. And that is time. The engine actually did survive that. But uh, it's not feeling too good. As you can see, the smoke is pouring out of Gravedigger Overcast. Hard landing on two wheels, and they break clean off. That'll do it for Gravedigger. Well, we've got our next truck up ready to go here. This one is called Marine Machine, and it's got a pretty slick paint job on it as well. I actually like this truck a lot. Check out the little decals on the bottom with the bombs falling out. That's pretty cool. So we're going to hopefully give this one a good run and get it started. So you know the drill, we'll go out, hit our first obstacle. After we hit the first obstacle, then we will start the three minute timer. And I promise that's probably the last time I'll say that this video, but let's go big, go home, first jump. Let's get it started there. Oh, landed it beautifully on that landing ramp. Look at that, just walked it out. You love to see it. See if we can hit a nice little bit of air right here. We do, some nice air. Oh, it's a relatively small jump compared to some of these other ones. Let's bring it around this way here. This angled ramp has not gotten a lot of love, but we can give it some. And up and over we go. The fire comes out. I will never get sick of looking at that fire coming out as we bicycle a little bit, but get it back and just kind of awkwardly hitting some jumps here. You got to flip this thing back around and get towards some ramps. Let's drink it. I kind of sling it through here. Oh, no. Come on. We got to do something with this. Oh, this is going to be bad. This is going to be bad. Look at this. I sound like Jeff Gordon. Oh, how do we get to get that back? We have got the saves mastered at this point, I would say. That that was pretty slick. All right, let's bring it up here again. Walk it over those crush cars. Give them something to remember us by. Oh, no. What a save again and into a wheelie. Come on now. Come on now, Marine Machine. What are you doing to us? You're giving us too much excitement. Let's go big and go over the stack again. The fire's coming out. We gotta combo it up. Oh, another ugly one. How are we gonna get it back? We shedded the body. We have shedded the entire body now. I promise you this is Marine Machine. And we're walking it out into a wheelie again. So we're about halfway through the run and we've already put on one heck of a show. 
Ooh, that's gonna be a hard landing right on the back of the truck. Ouch for the spinal cord once again. And gonna have another one. Oh man, we're giving out free spinal surgeries here today in the monster truck. We blew out a tire right there on that landing. Why did that just blow out? All right, well, fair enough, I guess. That's a bit unfortunate now. Oh, this is really unfortunate. Somehow we don't break a wheel off. Oh, this might do it. Talk about lucky. This is just the day of lucky bounces, I guess. We're getting these ones back that maybe we shouldn't. Let's see, we go the eight pack right here. Oh, that's not quite a backflip, but we'll take it. We will happily take it. That's better than flipping over. Oh, which we might do right here. Play with that gas, get it back, let it flip back over. Let it do the work for me. There you have it. I think we should come over here to the backflip ramps if I can get the truck to steer with that flat tire. Here we go. Oh, it's got some rotation on it. And let the truck settle back down again. Let's go back to that eight pack. Just sting it up the inside of that thing. Oh, made the gas in a little bit too hard right there. Have we turtled? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Beautiful. Let the truck do it for us. And you know what? With 10 seconds left, we're just gonna sing it into a donut. Why not? And that is gonna do it. The clock expires right there. And that was Marine Machine with another pretty solid run right there. All right, we see you. The engine's blowing up. We better get this thing to the back. All right, we've got our next truck up ready to go here. This is Cyberpunk back once again. And we're gonna hopefully give it another good run. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. Fire it up. And you know the drill. So we'll go ahead and start the run with some nice air off the top. Get hung up a little bit back on the tailgate there, but we're good. Let's start with the angle jump. Why not? Go straight for the crush cars up and over those. Clear them with the greatest of ease over the mound here. Crawling over that. I throw it up in the air again. We can with another sky wheelie. Let's go for some more air right here. And we're going to be able to slap this one into a slap. Really, can I walk it across? Maybe not. We might throw it into a bicycle. And I almost lose control. And I do crash into the wall. Giving the fans an up close and personal experience here today at the U.S. Bank Stadium. But we won't mind that. We'll go right back over the crush cars like nothing happened. And we'll walk it into a wheelie and a front flip potentially. But with some skew on it. And we get it back. Can we get it back? Oh, we get it back. And a wheelie to boot. Run over the own hood. It does not matter. We'll go for another maybe technical move right here. Can I, if I can get one rolling and we can do. But here's the here's the problem. Here's the problem. We did that technical move right into another jump. We're barely hanging on to it. We got some body panels that are barely hanging on. And I feel like we need to go for an early backflip. We need to show them we're here to play. We're here to play. We're here to do it on an angle too. And that was an ugly landing. Got all crossed up on the suspension. We'll bring it back around. This way, go for that same angle jump again, getting some nice distance, a little bit closer to this side right here. Back over the jumps on this side, just kind of cruising over those. And this truck, I love the look of this truck. I know what if, if you're out there, what if? This is his favorite truck, my man, what if racing. Oh, hard landing right there. Can we give this one a good run for my boy, what if? We gotta do it, we got to do it. We're about halfway through the run, actually quite a ways past it. So we got about a minute and 12 seconds to go. We sky it again with the sky wheelie. Oh, this is gonna get bad. This is gonna get bad. This is not what I meant. Oh, this is not what I meant. Did I turtle it? Did I turtle the truck? All right, we get one shot at this. All right, I'll give myself that one. I will give myself that one. And we immediately cross it up again on the next jump. Might as well go for it. We already flipped the truck over one time and saved it. I say saved it as in kind of cheated it, but we do that every now and then. We're out here for fun. Not realism all the time. Let's see if we can give it some full throttle air. Oh, get the rotation, baby. Yes. How about that for a massive backflip? Now we're letting it all hang out. We have got to give it our all. There have been some good runs up to this point, and we're not even that deep into the show. Oh, we wrecking crush cars over here, though. We just caved in the roof on one of them as we've got about 15 seconds left. We have got to start letting it hang out here. We got to come up with something to give them that wow factor. And I think I know just the thing to do it. Oh, I got a little bit too much. And we've turtled the truck once again. And luckily it comes back over to our side. But with two seconds left on the clock, I think we'll go ahead and let that one lay where it lies. We'll bring out the next truck.
All right, our next truck is ready to go here. We've got Heavy Hitter, which is a truck that I recognize from some YouTube videos that I've watched. I don't think we've ever used it before here in one of our videos. So let's go ahead and see what we can do with it. Let's fire it up. And let's go for it. You know the drill. Go straight for the A-pack. Why not? And go straight, potentially up and over. Rest that thing on the tailgate. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. We might have some technical moves here. Moonwalk. Oh, that's a bad place to do a moonwalk, but we pull it back out. We got lucky. We lost the hood already. Oh, well. Like, we haven't lost one of those before, and we'll back it straight up over into that jump. A nice flat landing. Got some nice air. We're starting things off right with heavy hitter. Hitting them heavy. Who would have thought? I know. Shock. Let's go for some big air back this way. This went well for us last time, and we're going to land that pretty nice as well, right down on the tailgate. And we'll bring that to a rest right before the wall. Almost hit it. Didn't quite. See if we can get up these. Another sky wheelie. Man, how many sky wheelies are we going to do today? I got to hit the reverse. Pull it back. Got lucky right there. Got to hit those things just right. Time them just right. You can pull them back. As many times as you please, really, as long as you got a little bit of luck on your side. You should be all right. Now, our early backflip has been working out for us so far. We'll try it again. That ramp is perfect for backflips. And I say that, and then I dump the truck on its side. What are we going to... Oh! Throw it in reverse and catch a wheel. That was beautiful. Oh, okay, that was maybe the luckiest save. I'm not even counting that as a cheat either. I think we just caught a wheel right there. The perfect spot. Hit the angle jump. Crash into the next mound. And just keep crashing. Doing donuts over here. Oh, man. Get the reverse again. Oh, man. Look at us. Look at this over here. Just look at this. The truck is going crazy. Once again, we've shedded another body. And I think we've turtled it. We were getting a little too wild with it. Wait a minute, we might have another shot here. Put it in full. Oh, what a save. Come on. Just had to give it a minute and a nice bicycle to boot. Get out of that one with. Talk about patience right there to let it come back to us. That was just a lucky roll. Letting gravity do the work for us. You know what? Another backflip. Can I get the consecutive going again? Oh, not quite, not quite, but it'll put us into a bit of a wheelie maybe. Couldn't get it all. Didn't start the timer. Just realized that. Must have missed the button. Oh, well. A pack is working. We'll feel it out from here. I think I've got about a minute left. We're going to go ahead and give ourselves another minute. Or at the very least, we'll just try to finish his runoff strong. With some nice air right there. Nosing it in. Oh, we're going to catch the end of this tanker. It's going to take us over on our roof. And we land it down and throw it into a moonwalk. Oh, standing it up. Have you ever seen anything quite like that? The improvisational skills. Let's throw it over the big jump one more time. We'll nose it in on purpose. Front flip it in maybe the most painful way possible. And we'll crash land it on this ramp over here. That was heavy hitter hitting them real heavy. Let's go get the next truck. Our next truck up is Plum Crazy, which is another truck that I don't believe we've used. I think this is one of the schemes that just kind of comes with the CRD mod. So we'll go ahead and try to give it a good run, as we always do. Fire it up, and let's get out on that track. And you know the deal, we'll hit the timer right now. Get some nice air off the start, land it immediately into a slab wheelie, and let's throw it into a backflip. Oh, we're not gonna get all this one hard on the nose. And that is not the way you wanna land your backflip. I get it into a bit of a slap wheelie right here, I'm gonna send it over. We're just gonna send it over, Plum Crazy is going crazy. Right off the start, and we get to save it into a moonwalk. Name a crazier truck start than that. We got to keep it rolling. We got to keep it rolling. We might not be able to keep it rolling. We lose a wheel. We have just broken off a wheel. Oh, the front suspension is completely destroyed. And now we got to work with what we got. This is not the most ideal scenario. Plum Crazy might have gone a little too crazy right off the start. Oh, we are just tossing around pieces of suspension right now. Let's try this thing going forward. This thing's got so much power in it, it just wants to lift that front end up now that it's a little bit lighter, missing a wheel. And I'm just kind of driving this thing around. Come on, we got to hit something. We got to try to at least. This front suspension's not doing me a lot of good. It's not helping. Oh, throwing it right up in the air. This is going to hurt on the landing. Oh, that's really going to hurt on the landing. I am very glad that we are not feeling what this driver would be feeling right now. And we just got to send it into something wild. We just got to send it into something wild. We have no choice. I don't know what's going on here. This is like a really 
really nasty turtle and that is already gonna do it for plum crazy that was a minute and 30 seconds half of a run right there but plum crazy looks like they did a run and then some so tough break for plum crazy breaks the wheel off right and early and that's a shame we'll get the next truck we've got another familiar face on our tour here monster energy ready to go let's go ahead and start it up put it in gear and let's get it begun let's take it around this way let's find a different way to start this off we've started our runs in a couple of different ways a lot of them kind of similar what do you say we roll ourselves up here maybe try to do some two wheel skills here to start it off i won't start the clock quite yet but we'll give ourselves some time just to set this one up let's do it clock has begun now let's try something cool there you go oh i almost had it wait we're getting it back here well, that was better than nothing. I'll take it. We had a, we held it for just a few short seconds, but a bicycle to boot. There you go. We'll throw it up over the tanker. Oh, gonna nose in hard and into a wheelie. Barely holding that nose up above us. Swing it back around this way, and let's just go. It's gonna gently over the crush cars. What do you say? And crush them down a little bit. Just give them some loving. Oh, we hit that jump kind of sideways, man. Twisting up that suspension. We thought we learned that the hard way last time and we would have learned some lessons from it but we never do and the trucks never do either another hard landing on the side of the truck and then throwing it into something what in the world and there goes the hood like we needed that i don't know what to call that move that was one of the weirdest bounces i've seen in this game what a backflip i'm not even meaning to do some of these moves and we're getting backflips out of them i don't know what to tell you and we're dancing around here Slinging this thing around. Uh, oh, wait a minute now. This might not be so good. It might also be great. We managed to get out of that one. All right, let's find something to do here. Should we go for the backflip? Never hurts to do one, right? Can we get the back consecutive out of this one? Not quite. Not quite. Put a little twist on that last one. We'll stick it on the tailgate once again. Bring it down. I don't know which way I'm trying to go here. We'll throw it in reverse. When in doubt, right? Do some Dan Evans stuff. Oh, oh man. What is going on? How do you even explain what we just saw? I can't do it. We're getting all twisted up, destroyed. We got a minute and 13 seconds left. We got to go ahead and finish this run off strong because we have had some wild runs. Some of the way these jumps are hooked up and set up, it's just perfect for ridiculousness to strike at any moment. Just like that, and when you're quick on the trigger of the transmission, you can pull out of them sometimes. Oh, maybe not all the times though. Oh, what a save. Look at that right there. Just working that transmission like it's nothing. And then we go ahead over heels. Can we pull it back? Oh, grab a wheel, grab a wheel, grab a wheel. What is going on? Let it roll, let it roll, let it roll. Perfect, and we shredded another one. How many bodies are we shredding today? All of them, apparently. We got bodies hanging out in crevices in the track. We've got 30 seconds to go. We got to get this one figured out. Let's go ahead and just wheelie it over top of that thing. And oh, watch out, watch out. Can I back it up? Moonwalk, very bad little baby moonwalk over the back. And we'll reverse it over top of that. And reverse it over this. Oh, no. Get it back. Easy as you please. And that is gonna be where the time expires. So Monster Energy sheds the truck of its body, puts a pretty good show on, and we'll go ahead and move on to the next run. Can you hear the crowd in the background? Sounds like they've been pretty entertained thus far, and we've still got three trucks to go, including this one. This is Hooligan. Another truck kind of making its debut here. We haven't used this one before, but I'm looking forward to it. We'll fire it up. And let's get this one started. Let's take this one over and hit it from a different side as well. We've done a lot of starting over here on this jump, starting over there on that jump. We got to try something different here. We're getting down to the end of the show. We've run over just about everything there is to hit out here. And we have got to figure something new out. So what can we do to make ourselves stand out on the start? Well, there's one thing I know I love, and that is amping up the crowd with some big air. So how much air can we get off of this jump right here? Let's find out. Let's back it all the way up to the wall and see what we can do about it. I will start the clock right now. 
and let's go. See if we can bring it back down right there. Nice air. Just got to let that engine roar. In. Oh, no. Saved. Saved it. Hey, don't, don't, don't mind that. Don't, don't even worry about that. We saved it. And then stuck it on the tailgate once again. And got a weird little bicycle going. We stick it back. Oh, we're getting lucky. We're getting some lucky brace today. We're, not, we're getting some very unlucky brace today. But we're getting some lucky ones too. Look at this. Look at that. Oh, how are we going to get it back? How do you get that back? Lucky brakes. Was I not just saying it? Oh, oh, just let the truck come back to you. Honestly, that's nine times out of ten. Just doing nothing is what works the best. Just let the truck figure it out for itself. I don't know what we call that. It was just a midair twist, but I'll, I'll take it. That was pretty cool looking. We are really good at just throwing this thing up in the air and letting it land right on the tailgate. Oh, and then just flipping it over and turtling the truck. Are we done? Are we done? Oh, we're catching some dirt. We're catching some dirt. But it's not going to be enough. Hooligan is spitting out smoke. And I get it. One, maybe one last attempt here. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. How is the engine not blown, first of all? Secondly, how are we getting it back? Oh, that engine is not feeling good. That engine is not feeling good. We are down on power. I can kind of feel it, I think, anyway. Unless I'm just crazy. Let's throw it into the backflip. There you go. Who needs power when you got air? I don't even know how to explain that. I guess we just got lucky. That truck was turtled. We caught some dirt in the perfect spot of that ramp sitting there. Oh, and the engine's blown. The engine is blown. And it's... I, well, now what? I'm just stuck up here. Well, at least it'll make for a good photo for the fans in the stands up here. As much as I'd love to probably just leave this thing up here to be an obstacle, I'm pretty sure my PC would implode with how unstable this game is right now, so... Unfortunately, that's going to do it for Hooligan. The engine is blown, and we'll go to the next truck. Well, we got our next truck lined up and ready to go, and it's another throwback truck from the Retro Pack, which I absolutely love. This is no problem, and uh, hopefully it gives us no problem. We've had a couple of problems out here today, so hopefully these retro ones will, uh, will give us some help. And the Retro Pack has been really fun to use. It's one of the few that actually works at this point, from what I've been able to tell, so I definitely appreciate them. And hopefully we can give it a good run. Fire it up, put it in gear, and let's go ahead and get this run started. We're not going to give it any kind of opening theatrics. We need to get a run going. We'll start the timer, and we'll try and give ourselves another run to remember as we walk it across, kind of cross, turn it across. A couple of jumps there. Let's see if we can hit this angled one. Luckily, that other truck's out of the way now. That's not going to cause us any kind of problems up there. As much as, a, much as I would have loved to keep it up there, unfortunately, it would absolutely kill the FPS worse than it probably already is hurting. I can only imagine that uh, the FPS is probably a little bit down because uh, for whatever reason, Beam is just feeling really weird to me for whatever reason. But we got to keep the run going. We're bicycling. Oh, I might have turned the wrong way there, but we'll just bring it back the other way. Who cares? No problem, right? No problem. Exactly. See, and we're going to stand it up on the tailgate, knock a bunch of body panels loose, and throw a wheelie in there while we're at it. Why not? Walk it out. We'll get this thing turned around here. Go over the crush car stack again. Walk it over the top of it, maybe. There we go. You got to love that. Sometimes it's nice to just walk and crush rather than get big air and crash, which we're doing anyway. And we're gonna, just going to let the truck roll back over. Flipped out of gear there. Let's get some air across this one. Do a little cross threading here. So we throw it into a backflip. Can we throw it in? And we get consecutives again. Oh, I don't know if you can count that. It was a bit ugly and we're not done yet. We got another save coming up hot and ready. No problemo. And we have got a pretty good run going here already as we're about halfway through. We're going to hit that container. We're going to do a bit of a spin in midair. And we're going to get it back on the landing ramp. I swear, I, as much as I'd love to claim talent, skill, and ability for a lot of these moves, I think luck plays into it a good bit, and just awesome physics of Beam and G do as well. Look at that, an accidental bicycle didn't even mean to do that. How about it? Bounce it over the top of these jumps, and honestly, I don't even know what to call half the moves we're doing, and, and I don't know, just another bicycle on accident. Why not? Just add them all in there. We'd love to ride our bicycle out here. 
We'll see what we can do with this jump here. I love to try and do something tactical like that, but then you miss the lineup, and then you screw it all up, and that's just a sound head way, I guess. So let's get some big air again. Pull that nose down. Land hard on the right. Oh, what is going on? Just gas it out. When in doubt, gas it out. Even though I say usually just let the truck roll. Now I'm contradicting myself. Doesn't make any sense, but it really does. This is a monster truck. It's not rocket science. And that's a backflip out of nowhere, because why not? And into a bit of a wheelie. And you know what? One backflip was nice. Let's throw another one in there, too. And let's throw another one in there, too. And let's throw another one in there, too. Oh, with a twist on it. I thought that was going places. That was looking good. I can't believe I called a couple of those. Hey, sometimes it's nice when things work out for you. Ten seconds to go. One final move is in order. What should we do? What can we do? Let's do it. And I walk it out, baby. Oh, we almost went backwards over. We still might. Can I save it? Can I end the run with a save? Or a flip and a turtle. Perfectly as time is expiring. Went a little over about 12 seconds over. But that move was all one giant combo. So I'll count it. I'll count it. Trucks upside down. Turtled. You hate to see it or you love to see it, depending on what kind of fan you are. And that'll pretty much do it for no problem. Had majorly no problems until the very end. So we're down to one and it's the winner of our previous show. Let's get the final run underway. All right. And we are down to one final truck. And like I said, it was the winner of the fan vote last time we were out here in BMG Drive. It is cracking. Ready to go. Kick off the show. To end our show, hopefully we can give it a nice run. Let's go ahead. Fire it up. Put it right in gear. Hey, you know what? I think we need to start this run with a backflip. And if we biff it right here, that's going to be hilarious. But let's go ahead, throw the backflip in there, start the timer, and we've got our backflip going. Let's go ahead and continue this one and get some moves in for Kraken. Just kind of crawling over some jumps right now. Throw it into a little bit of a sky wheelie and then see if we can turn around before crashing into the wall. That would be nice. See if we can get a little bit of distance on this jump. We do. We'll power out of it as well. Turn it around back the other way. Give these crush cars a bit of a buzz by. How about that? Beautiful and landed on the landing ramp. You love to see it and combo it up. That's some of the nicest air we've got over that jump so far today. And that suspension looked like it didn't land totally comfortably. We might have just broken the bottom of this truck already. But you know what? We have got two minutes and 15 seconds left to go. We can walk the truck around for a little bit of that time. Why not? See if we can get it turned around, period, before crashing into some seats. We don't want to do that. Let's hit this one right here. Stick it up again in the air. That nose has been up in the air all day. Am I going for a backflip again? We are. We just are. And you know what? I'd try a consecutive one, but I think we're be pressing our luck if we did it. But maybe we'll just go back for another one again. The hard way or the easy way, depending on how you look at it. Probably is the easy way. Those consecutive ones require a good bit of luck and timing. So let's walk it back over the jumps here. Oh, there goes the hood. Who needs you? We'll sling this thing around here. Should I sling it into a bit of a donut? We've had a couple of donuts today. Oh, I might flip the truck over trying. And instead, we get a beautiful save out of it. There you go. But we'll crawl over some jumps right here. And we are crawling all over them, getting all cockeyed and start around up. This is going to be an awkward bounce. This is going to be a really awkward bounce. That's what I was worried about, but just power out of it. Just power out of it. Let a wheel snag. And let's get going again. More air, more sky wheelies. This is just sky wheel, sky, sky wheel, sky wheelie city. And somehow we're getting more saves out of this thing. I don't I, I can't explain it. I really can't. Let's go sideways cross thread over the crush cars. Let the fire. I'm going to drive right through the fire. Like I care at all about the fire. Come on. This is a monster truck. Fire is nothing to me. I'm made of fire. Look at that engine. This is a beast. It's a Kraken, actually, if we want to be specific. Let's get it. Come on. Oh, that's going to hurt the rear suspension. All right, this thing is trashed. All right, we got to be careful now. We've got about 35 seconds remaining with a destroyed truck. That suspension is hurt. That's not helping. That's a bad angle. That's a really bad angle. Oh, 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 22 seconds remaining. What can we do? What can we do to give Kraken a shot at a repeat win? I don't know. With a broken truck like this, it's not going to be easy. Oh, turning the hard way. But let's just take one run at it. 10 seconds down to six seconds, actually. And we're cross-eyed. We're crashing. 
This is it. Can I pull it out? The clock has expired and we're gonna land it on the wheel somehow. Somehow, some way, crashing into the wall with a destroyed suspension. We get it back once again. Cracking, ladies and gentlemen, and a full show has been completed. 10 trucks, and what a bunch of wild runs it was. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that. If you did, hit that like button for me. Subscribe if you haven't already, because we'll be doing plenty more. And with that, I will see you all in the next one. Peace!